Hi, Bumblebee. I've had a very busy morning. I, uh, first of all, I made a schedule, like Chris uh, said, a schedule for every day. And I pretty much kept to it today. Uh, and I got a lot of shopping done. Anyway, this is Shirley from Shirley's World. Uh, I'm doing an eBay haul video. I sell on eBay. I sell some on Poshmark. And uh, I tried Mercari, which didn't go too well. So I'm not really selling on Mercari. But <clears throat> mostly eBay is my uh, thing that I sell on. So I got a box from Bumblebee. Yes, you. <laughs> it came today. It was waiting for me when I got home from Goodwill. I went to Goodwill at about 10.30 this morning, and I got out of there about 1.30. So I spent three hours, and I got 42 or 41 items. And I spent, before my 35% off coupon, it was $167. But with, with my coupon plus tax, it was $116.49. Uh, which is, I would like to do $100 uh, buys all the time. But sometimes I just can't. Uh, stay in there that long or there's just not enough stuff but today I was bound and determined uh, I had I had my coupon but and I had points toward the next one so I was bound and determined to buy enough that I would get two more coupons which I did I was successful so I haven't uh, figured out how much this is going to be per piece uh, 41 items, $116.49, divided by 41. So $2.84 each thing, it comes down to average. So that's really good. However, I'll have to take a couple off of that because uh, when I go through them, I'm going to do your box today, Bumblebee, if that's okay. Uh, I'll do my big haul from Goodwill tomorrow because I'd like to get it out of the bags and I'll put some on hangers and do it from when I do it from up there because I think you can see better. But uh, your things are folded so nicely, I can just put them up on the hangers behind me. Uh, but the ones in the bags, she folded them pretty good when she put them in the bags, but they're just stuffed in there. So I want to get them out of the bags <coughs> later on, let them hang a little bit. <coughs> and um, so I'm going to do uh, your box today. And then I'll be on again tomorrow at 4 o'clock. Hi, Nancy. Hi, hi, Sue. Yeah, I have loads of inventory now. I got Bumblebee's box today. And I think that's around 20 items, right, Bumblebee? 20 or 25 items. I'm not sure. I think 20. But um, I'll, I'm going to open that one today. And then tomorrow I will be on and do this tremendous uh, haul I got from Goodwill today. I was in Goodwill, like I said, three hours and got 41 items. Now, a couple of the items I'll pull from there because I did get a couple T-shirts for myself that because I need to replenish, replenish my T-shirts in my closet. Yet, there's 20 items in Bumblebee's box. So, uh, I still have a few things that I haven't listed from before. There's The jeans are right there. I have to list them yet. 
but uh, so far today I've sold three items, which is okay. I sold them when I was in shopping. So I'm going to open Bumblebee's box here. I just slit the box open. So I haven't. <coughs> Okay, get this closer to me. Okay. I have been sleeping on the couch in the family room for the last few nights. Uh, because Dexter is not doing real well, and I want him to... Uh, know that I'm there. I don't want him to have to climb the steps to go upstairs when he's hunting for me. So um, I've been sleeping on the couch, which isn't very good for my back. <laughs> but surprisingly enough, I am able to sleep, which I didn't even know if I'd be able to sleep, but I am. So I've gotten, you know, my normal night's sleep, but if he wants to go out or something, I can hear him get up and uh, his, his nails are so long, he taps on his, my hardwood floor so I can hear him. It wakes me up right away. This is the bright, colorful summer box. Oh, good. Okay. <laughs> pretty. This first thing is very colorful. Bobby Brooks. <laughs> Bobby Brooks, I think, is, is, I'm not sure if it's Bobby Brooks, is located in Cleveland, I believe, is where it started at. Anyway, uh, this could be, I'm not sure if Bobby Brooks is still going or not. This could be a vintage thing. I don't know how to tell on this tag, but hmm. I'll have to look up Bobby Brooks and see if uh, what their tags look like now, if they have any. This is a short sleeve denim little shirt, button up shirt, and it has uh, pretty garden flowers and hummingbirds all over it. How nice. This is a small, unfortunately, or I may keep, I may have kept this. Uh, yeah, but it would be tight on me. So really pretty little summer blouse. Very summery with the garden. So, uh, Judy just sent me a video of a, a young girl. She's 14 and she is um, there, she's going to take lessons on, uh, echo. So this was her first lesson today. And she sent me the video of, of her riding echo with, of course, Judy was right beside them. Uh, yeah, Dexter, I'm afraid he's not going to feel better. He has good days and bad days, but this isn't a good diagnosis he got. So uh, I'm sure I'm. I'm just hoping that he has some good days. Uh, he had one the other day. He found a chipmunk outside. It was under the boat, which I have this big boat in my driveway for my son's boat, and underneath there. There's lots of places where chipmunks can hide. So there what must have been a chipmunk. And I took video of it. And he was like a young young pointer again, uh, hunting for this chipmunk. Okay, the uh, vintage embroidered shacket, I can call that. Yes. Okay, good. Lazy bone. I've never heard of this. <laughs> this is cute. 
what does it say too 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 tired too tired like tires i guess too tired that's me too tired <laughs> I could have this as one of my t-shirts to take over uh, my shirts in my closet. I was looking through them today and <clears throat> at least three quarters of my t-shirts up there need to be thrown out. They aren't even, I wouldn't even take them to Goodwill. So, uh, yeah, this is cute. Too tired. Three quarter sleeves. Very cute. This all has to do with summer. Okay. Now I have some shoes here. Right on top that I'm going to open. Looks like you have some washi tape. Did you see the video when uh, Becky was going through her house, showing her house and how she has her things laid out in all different rooms of uh, her eBay, her uh, reselling business. And then the uh, she showed about all her organizers and her washi tape and drawers and drawers of these organizers. And she said she has a problem. <laughs> I, I believe she's right. <laughs> Let me get this other shoe. Uh, and they have, each one has things. Is this something in there? I'm not sure. Maybe not. That just feels like paper, but I will unwrap it just to make sure. Uh, these are, oh, bear traps. These are little slip-on platform, uh, little sandals. Slip-on sandals for summer. It's a little heel by bear traps in a size six. So cute. I almost found a pair of shoes today, but I got to the cash register and I looked at them again and they just had too much wear on the one heel. So I was good and I put them back and didn't buy them, but they were Merrill, uh, Merrill shoes. So these are cute. <sighs> Oh, I better, I'm gonna, better just look at this. Just to make sure this doesn't have a hidden treasure in here. No, this is just paper. Okay. Uh, Jack, hi. Sue, look who's here, Jack. He comes to my uh, YouTube videos sometimes. Yeah, this is my grandson, Jack. And he uh, is going. He watches some of my uh, unboxings. Uh, this is a little shorts, paisley shorts, and this is by Kenzie, I think Kenzie, size twelve. Aren't those pretty? I was keeping, I've tried to buy some more shorts today because uh, Chris says he's putting all the shorts he can on for the summer. So I only got a couple. So these are pretty, pretty. And I did sell a, a pair of booty shorts today also. Uh, yeah, size 12. It's a very flowery box. Ambiance apparel. 
size small. This is sheer, a sheer blouse, a button up blouse as a pocket, um, two, two pockets, two breast pockets and three quarter sleeves. Maybe just elbow sleeves. I'm not sure they're even three quarter sleeves. So really pretty summery blouse. <clears throat> Jack, tell your dad to call me tonight or I'll call him. You guys are planning on going down to Florida this summer? Kind of hot down there right now. Wait till the hurricane passes. Uh. That hurricane came right in around Tampa, but it wasn't a hurricane at the time. It was a uh, uh, tropical storm. <laughs> and remember, Sue, we stayed down at the house down there through one of the uh, tornado, one of the not tornadoes, hurricanes. What hurricane was that that we were down there for? Do you remember the name of it? Here's a, a uh, brand new, another B B Bobby Brooks, Bobby Brooks ladies. This, look, this is a little dress, little mini dress. Oop. Yes, it's new with tags. At least one, one tag says Bobby Brooks. Doesn't have the price tag. But a cute little mini dress, or maybe a tunic. I think it's a mini dress in a size medium. It's so soft. It's soft and uh, stretchy, like it would be like almost non-wrinkle. Something good to pack for Florida. <laughs> Not for you, Jack, or maybe your sister. Okay, this is another tag. One with the tag says Bebop. Made with love and worn with love. Okay. Ah, another little mini dress. I'm glad because I just can't get dresses except in that one place I go. This is a cute little has has strap. Whoops, wrong. There, that's the front, and it has ruffles here at the bottom. Three tiers of ruffles at the sides. I guess they're just at the sides, and at the back has a tie that you can adjust. So this is um, bebop in a medium. Very pretty and cool for summer. <laughs> You're not very late, Jack. Uh, I don't think I have any men. I may have one men's things tomorrow, but I didn't shop. It was mostly women's things. I have a couple men's things, but nothing your size. Uh, Chico, size one. Oh, this is pretty. Great orange with leaves. Three quarter, I think these are roll up. They have a tab and button there. Roll up sleeves. This looks nice and cool. And the Chico's one, which is a medium, I think. Let me see. <clears throat> yes, a medium or size eight. So if my uh, daughter-in-law, Linda, would wear 
some bright colors. We keep kidding her because all she wears is black and grays <laughs> and white, of course. But that would look real pretty on her. <clears throat> Okay, 7th Avenue, New York and Company. This is also a new with tags. This was priced at $36.95. This is small. Okay, this is a fitted, fitted blouse, button-up blouse. With the, it's all fitted, uh, long short sleeves. That doesn't make sense, but they're longer than normal. They're short, but I guess you'd call those elbow sleeves uh, in a small, in this pretty uh, lime green color. Maybe I'm going to, I think the drafts I put on today, I went from five to six. I'm sort of creeping up on 10. I know that's an awfully lot. Ten, if I do 10 every day, I'd have to really get a lot of inventory. So maybe I'll stay at six for a while. <laughs> oh. My daughter, the lady behind her, gave her, I think, five more bags of stuff. <laughs> she is set for a long time if she ever starts. Okay, this is by Nicole and an extra small. Oh, this has cold, a cold shoulder where your shoulder peeks out there. These pretty sleeves. This is coral and leaves and butterflies. And it's just a, a pull on, pull over your head type blouse. Very colorful. Makes me want to go to Florida. These things. <clears throat> so. I'm sorry we sold the place, <laughs> but yeah, it was meant to be. Everybody would. Everybody said if I didn't sell the place, they'd they'd come visit all the time. But I don't think that that really would hold up for very long, and I'd be all by myself. These are a pair of uh, capris. Now these are very cute. Bill Glass, this definitely looks like vintage. Uh, is this vintage? This looks like a vintage tag. Bill Glass, stretch. Look at the pattern on this. It's, it's all kinds of uh, people and places. People and places. It's a button and zip opening and it's a size 10. Little uh, pair of capris. Look at that. I could have worn those to the sandbar in Florida when we went out to dinner. Yes, vintage. Okay. Remember the sandbar, Sue? Right on the beach. Were you with us the day, the time that we uh, drove the boat up there and jumped out of the jumped out and the, we anchored the boat and then we jumped out of the boat and swam ashore and went and ate lunch there. Were you with us that time? 
I'm not sure who was with us one. If I can find the top to this, good. The limited. I used to shop in the limited when I was young, and so did my daughter, I think. This is a drapey neck in this pretty teal. Now, it's more teal colored than it's looking on the screen. It looks blue on there, but this is actually like a deep teal color. Little cap sleeves. It's a nice fabric that doesn't wrinkle. It's packable. This is an extra small. Jack, you should tell Ava. She should watch these, uh, my fashion videos. <laughs> if she, if you guys lived closer, I would try to talk Ava into modeling some things for my pictures. This is J. Jill Petite. This is Large Petite. And it is a dress, sleeveless dress, v-neck, with all kinds of floral. And again, this is, oh, this opens, has a slit there in the front. This is that packable fabric also. Of course, to go to Florida, you really have to fly. I don't fly anymore. And I'm watch the movie I'm watching on Netflix is um, called Manifest. Has anybody seen that Manifest? Yeah. <laughs> uh Oh, she does? She watches? She's secret about it, though. She never tells me she's here. Maybe she watches it after the fact. But anyway, this movie manifests. I thought it was just going to be a movie, but it turns out it was a series. I'm still watching it. I binge-watched it the other day, the other evening. Uh, it's about a... Without giving anything away, it's about a plane that takes off and disappears, doesn't land, and they think it's crashed and everybody's died. And then all of a sudden, it lands five years later. I think it's five years. Five years later, it lands, and all these people get off, and they don't, they don't know that they've been gone all that long. They think they've just been gone the time it took to get to the their destination. And everybody else, you know, these they think these people had died and they hadn't, and they just came back. And it's all about what what happened and why. And anyway, it's sort of good. I've been watching it. Uh, here is a blouse by Orvis which I don't normally always pick up. Orvis is a good brand. It's three-quarter sleeves. Like a cotton button front. Uh, blouse, what size are you? In a size 12, in my collar. Look at that. Hmm. Uh, I heard of it. What What are you talking about? Oh, Eiffel Tower. Oh, yeah, on those on those capris. Yes, it was Eiffel Tower. Okay, Justice. Now, I know 
This justice is 20 plus. Now, I thought justice was just young people's or kids' clothes. Obviously not. This is a cold shoulder, and it ties, the sleeve ties right there. Oh, look it. That's some more Eiffel Towers. <laughs> that means something to Sue, too. 20 plus. This is that um, ombre, the way it goes from light to dark. With Eiffel Towers all over. This Eiffel Towers are kind of sparkly also. I don't know if that shows up there. Probably not. That's different. I never saw anything like that. Now, if I would just see, you know, go through the racks and see that brand, I would probably just pass it up because I just thought Justice was just kids' clothes. I have no idea about the name, but I remember taking videos near the shore. Oh, you've heard, Jack, you've heard of it. Are you talking about the Sandbar restaurant? I'm sure your father has taken... Well, when was the last time you were down there, you kids? You were real little, right? It's not far from the house. It's not far from the house. I'm not sure if it's within walking distance or not. It may be. Yes, come to think of it, I think it is. I think we rode our bikes when we were riding bikes down there. We could ride the bikes over there. <clears throat> the Sandbar restaurant is the one with the deck, the big deck that we'd watch the sunsets. We never ate inside. We always ate out on the deck. These are little capris. J&P, Jeans Company. I never heard of that, but they have a tag. J&P Denim Jeans. But they're sparkly. They have some bling on the pockets. And a big rhinestone button. And they're dark wash in their little capris with turned up cuffs. And they're stitched there. So cute little denim capris. Fold it that way. <clears throat> Just three more things. Look at this cute pair of shorts. These are called Breeze something. I have no idea. Oh, Breeze Ever. Okay, Breeze Ever. And the size large. These are very uh, cool little short shorts with... Uh, Crocheted uh, lace hem. How cute. And elastic waist and a tie. And size large. Very cute. Too big for you, Ava. <laughs> your, your mother wouldn't let you wear that short of shorts, I don't think. Ellen Negley. Never heard of this. Ellen Negley. I'll have a lot to look up. This is art and something. This is an extra large. 
has tropical scene on there with boats. It's signed Ellen Negley down there also. And the back has an open place right here where your back shows, your shoulders show a little bit. Pretty summery top. Ellen Negley. No, the TV. Oh, the manifest. Yeah, it's kind of kind of strange. It's good, but it's a series. So it's not just a two hour movie. It sucks you in and you have to watch for hours and hours and days. <laughs> Whoop, I should hang this up. Uh, yeah. I think you'd like it. I think your dad'd like it too. <clears throat> One more thing. I'm always sad when I get to the end of the box. This has a uh, fringe. Whoop. Oh, there's a present. <laughs> This is a scar. Is this a scarf? Yes. This is a beautiful scarf, square, with a tassel fringe. Isn't that pretty? Is this a scarf or a, you never know how you open it? Because it could be like a poncho, but it's not. Look at that. That is gorgeous. I don't know if it has a tag. No tag, but that's a beautiful wrap scarf. So that was a, like you said, a very summery box. Because I didn't get any of that kind of stuff today. So that's good. And I get to open this little gift. <laughs> What is this? I may have to cut this. Did you put this in a knot? <laughs> yes, you did. Now, where's my scissors? Of course, they're way over there. So I have to get my huge. Look at these scissors. They are frightening, aren't they? I don't even know where I got them. I have no idea, but they're the longest scissors I've ever seen. They look like something from a horror movie. <laughs> okay. This is a necklace, I think. Or some sort of jewelry. Oh, yes. Look at that. This is a necklace. It has little charms on it. Palm trees. Sunscreen. Sunglasses. Oh, is this ever cute? How cute. How could you bear to give that away? That is so cute. I've never seen anything like this. Of course, I never look at jewelry. I love that. And it has a little pair of uh, thongs, too. Sunglasses, thongs, a palm tree, and sunscreen. Those are the uh, little charms. Thank you so much. That is so cute. Oh, that is, I assume you want me to sell that. <laughs> I don't know. I may wear it a little bit first. 
if I ever go on any place that I would uh, wear a necklace. Yes, that was an awesome box. <laughs> I love all your boxes. I'm about halfway through the, the health and beauty one, though. I like the clothes ones better <laughs> because the health and beauty items, they're so, they're, they're so much work to, uh, to list because they don't all show up when you uh, question about them on Amazon or eBay or even with my little gun to do the UPC thing. They don't show up. And then you're stuck with trying to figure out what to say about them. And I'm always worried about anything uh, that has to do with the health category. You know, I don't want, you have to say the right things and you have to put all the right warnings and stuff on there. If you don't find one that's already on there. <laughs> anyway. That was a great box, Bumblebee. Thank you so much. Don't forget to send the invoice. Uh, I am going to, um, what I'm going to do, take this these things upstairs and let them hang, hang out a little bit. And then I'm going to take the stuff out of the bags from, from my haul from Goodwill today, get them hung up and try to get a rack uh, for a tomorrow's video so they'll show up better instead of dragging them out of the uh, out of the bags because if they're in the bags overnight, they're going to be a mess by tomorrow. So that's why I want to get them out and hung up first. So... Yes, great video, great uh, box. Scarves are in right now. Oh, tie and a halter top. Oh. Hey, now I would have never thought of that. Uh, yeah, I'll have to uh, experiment on my mannequin. Sorry, the other items are hard. Wait. I was finding them easily online by typing in whatever it said on the package. I I don't know. I was doing that, and some of them did show up, but not all of them. So I've, I've done pretty much the easier ones first, and I still have at least half, half the box out there to uh, put on. But they're good to fill in with uh, in between when I didn't have any clothes. I was filling in with them and my horse training videos. <laughs> uh, so, my, uh, I have to tell you this, my dentist, the one that I was going to every few days about my fitting, uh, her and her husband went off to Hawaii for two weeks. I think it's their anniversary. She's never been to Hawaii. And she was like leaving the next day after I saw her last. So she won't be back till like the 22nd of July. So I'm hoping everything stays okay here. Yeah, let me put this up. The, the Ellen Negley top, I believe, I sent you a summer ago or, or so. Thought you could sell similar. Oh, okay. I don't remember that name at all, but I'll look it up. I'll look to see if I have one. Ellen Negley. Doesn't sound familiar, but we'll see. Is it different style? Yeah, art to wear. Yeah, there's some. There's um, several people that design clothes that 
there's sort of art to wear. I'll look up art to wear too. Yeah. You know, some somebody on Poshmark uh, sent me a note today and asked me if one of my suits, men's suits, the uh, Ralph Lauren suit was still available. Now it's marked way down, I think to $30 or something. So I told her, yes, it was still available. Now, I suppose she's waiting for me. I, it, it is marked way down. I marked it down a couple times. She probably is expecting me to give her mark it down even more after she asked that, but I don't think I'm going to. J. Jill is new with tags. Okay. Which one was that? One of these. Yeah, I see. Oh, okay. Oh, and it has the name of the pattern on it too. Black, black something. Okay, yes. A lot of new with tags things there. Several. So thank you. I'm really anxious to uh, have my daughter open her bags and see what she has. Uh, now she's trying to figure out where she's going to put all this stuff. She had the bags sitting in her garage. I said, get them out of the garage. You can't put half things in a plastic bag out in the garage where it's humid because we've had some really humid weather here. Of course, now it's turned uh, nice. But she needs to bring the things in. She doesn't know whether to buy hanging racks or bins. So that's what she's making her mind up. She has to go. Uh, she has to decide how she wants to uh, store her inventory. So, anyway, I'm going to close for now, and I will be back tomorrow, same time, same place. Uh, maybe a different setup, and I will uh, show you what I got at the Goodwill today a lot of stuff. Some good, some sort of just, you know, I was bound determined to get my second <laughs> coupon, so I was just buying like crazy. Uh, bye, Nancy. Hope you can come back tomorrow. Jack will be here tomorrow, too. Thank you, Jack. I love when you come. Uh, you think the Bill Blass uh, print is so cute. Let me see. The girl walking her dog. Yes. <laughs> she needs to come out. You're right. She needs to come out and watch me work. And, and she could help, you know, she could see how I ship. She could see how I do the pictures, although she doesn't need, she knows how to take pictures. She's a photographer. But what she does have to do is learn to do it quickly and not be so, you know, perfect. She's a perfectionist, so you can't do that when you're taking, when you want to be quick. Uh Yeah. Okay, I will be back tomorrow. Hope everything goes well with everybody and with Dexter. And I will uh, see you then. Bye. <laughs>